Hi, Hiram here. Last couple of days I've been playing with this internal corrugated aluminum pot stand idea. This was the first one I did where it was an under 3 gram stove, complete stove with burner and pot stand. This actually weighs 2.6 grams. Then I went a little bit larger, putting it in my coddle stove with a wick on it. In there, you'll, you can see the old videos. The other videos, I should say. Anyway, Flash Geiger sent me a comment wondering how would it work with a Trangia. So I thought maybe that's what I'd try today. Here we have the Trangia. Been playing with this, using this. This is my favorite burner. Mainly because I guess <clears throat> even though it's heavy, you can put alcohol in here and when you're done burning, just save it. But the, uh, I don't know how to say this. I'm not knocking this, but this is the West Wind pot stand that I got to go with this. <clears throat> got this back in 2009. Did some earlier videos. I'll put the links down below for it. With this pot stand, uh, Trangia, I know, it's Trangi, Tranja. Anyway, I'm an old fart. Trangia is how I first heard it pronounced, so that's how I'm going to have to say it. The Trangia in this brought my standard pot, which is the same diameter as the pot that I use now, only it was taller. It brought two cups of water to a boil in 9 minutes and 14 seconds. I used a hardware cloth pot stand on this, which I think I put on the outside edge and it dropped the time down to 6 minutes and 26 seconds. I don't know, it kind of looks like the pot stands like this act like big heat sinks. Also they're very heavy. This weighs 80.9 grams or 2.85 ounces. I made a little corrugated pot stand here, 2.5 inches tall, just the length of whatever you want. This weighs 3.5 grams or 0.12 ounces. So you could get like what, 20 of these for the same weight as that. It just goes into the Trangia like that. Oh, I also had people asking me, where do you get the aluminum foil that they don't have pie pans. Now the pie pan was just for the first one because that was just a little piece. What I've been using are these aluminum trays that you can get at any dollar store. These come in packs of two for a dollar and that gives you lots of space for cutting up strips. Okay so I have my other Trangia here that has methanol in it. Again I punch the hole in it so that when the pot sits on this, you don't get a lot of vapor pressure. It all just comes out the hole. Put that in there like so. Now with playing with this, I found out you can't just light it the same old way where you light down in. You have to put some alcohol on this edge and let it preheat that way. So put a little methanol there. light this up. Okay, we'll let this go until it gets to a bloom. Like I said, I do like the trans Transia uh, just because I like it. It's one of my favorite alcohol stoves, burners. You just have to come up with some sort of a pot stand to put with it. Okay, this heats up from the outside. By the time this alcohol is burned off out here, the jet should light. There we go. Okay, so I have two cups of water here. Setting at 61 degrees. I'll just put that on there and try to center it. And let's see where that goes. Boy, that jumped up fast. Okay, let's see where this goes.
And here we have 210, 211, to 12 and 623 okay not bad huh okay let me take this off one of the other things that I like about the Trangia is that this thing is kinda hard to put out so the breeze doesn't just you know fluff it out see it just won't blow out. Now, it, the wind carries away the heat, but it just doesn't blow out easy. And I mean, I'm really trying here. So what you end up having to do is take your pliers and just pull this out. Now it's going to be burning because there's alcohol on it. Just let it burn out. Set it aside. And then put it out with your simmering. That reminds me, uh, you won't be able to use your simmering when this is using this internal corrugated pot stand. But the number of times that I've used my simmering is pretty much only for baking, so that's not a hardship for me. Just put it out like that. Not bad. It's already lost its heat that I can hold it. So this has been burned three times now and I don't see any damage with it. I don't see any melting. The thing is this is on the inside of the flame so it's not really probably being hit by the flames like the other pot stands are. Okay that was two cups of water starting at 61 degrees and it got to a boil in 6 minutes and 23 seconds. On the other test that I did with the hardware cloth back in 09, the room temperature was 81 degrees. Right now the room temperature in here is about 54, so there's a little bit of difference there. Even so, this came out faster by 3 seconds. Also the different pot might be doing it too because the other pot was taller, but it shouldn't have made that much difference. So that's two cups of water to a boil in 6 minutes and 23 seconds. In my opinion, this does work with the Trangia. Now you can just take these and, you know, cut yourself a couple of these, roll them up into a bottle or roll them up on themselves so that they protect each other and just put that in your cook kit. So I thank Flash Geiger for question, asking about this. I thank you for watching my videos. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions, and as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now. No, you've been a good friend. And that's in the thick and thin.